a third-generation programming language is a generational way to categorize high-level computer programming languages. Where assembly languages, categorized as second-generation programming languages, are machine-dependent, 3GLs are much more machine-independent and more programmer-friendly. This includes features like improved support for aggregate data types, and expressing concepts in a way that favors the programmer, not the computer. A third-generation language improves over a second-generation language by having the computer take care of non-essential details. 3GLs feature more abstraction than previous generations of languages, and thus can be considered higher-level languages than their first- and second-generation counterparts. First introduced in the late 1950s, Fortran, ALGOL, and COBOL are early examples of this sort of language. Most popular general-purpose languages today, such as C, C++, C, Java, BASIC and Pascal, are also third-generation languages, although C++, Java and C follow a completely different path as they are object-oriented in nature. Third generation focused on structure and had no meaning for the object-oriented concepts. Most 3GL support structured programming. A programming language such as C, Fortran, or Pascal enables a programmer to write programs that are more or less independent from a particular type of computer. Such languages are considered high-level because they are closer to human languages and further from machine languages. In contrast, assembly languages are considered low-level because they are very close to machine languages. The main advantage of high-level languages over low-level languages is that they are easier to read, write, and maintain. Ultimately, programs written in a high-level language must be translated into machine language by a compiler or interpreter. The first high-level programming languages were designed in the 1950s. Examples of early high-level languages are ALGOL, COBOL, and Fortran. These programs could run on different machines so they were machine-independent. As new, more abstract languages have been developed, however, the concept of high- and low-level languages have become rather relative. Many of the early high-level languages are now considered relatively low-level in comparison to languages such as Python, Ruby, and Common Lisp. See also, domain-specific programming language, fourth-generation programming language, references.